Hey guys, so I realized I forgot something from the previous video. So let's say you're given a function and then you want to differentiate it twice. Um, in other words, you're given some expression, um, as you can see from my whiteboard, and then you're asked to differentiate this function twice. Okay, so basically, um, you know, take the derivative with respect to x not once, but do it again. So do it two times, okay? And the, the million dollar question is, how can we do this in MATLAB? And it's it's actually super simple. So let me go to my command window. And again, I'm choosing relatively easy examples here just to drive the point home. Um, if you wanna see more difficult examples, I've got like a whole um, two separate videos um, solving 10 derivative problems um, using MATLAB that, you know, I'll leave a link in the description for you to check it out, okay? So I'm gonna to go to my command window. And then one thing I forgot, I'm gonna call each of these expressions as f of x. So essentially I'm gonna make this a function, okay? So I'm basically for the first problem, I'm saying f of x is equal to six x raised to the fourth power plus four x um, raised to the sixth power, okay? And then I'm also gonna, I'm also gonna choose, um, call my second problem and f of x just to make this into a function, okay? So I'm gonna to go to my MATLAB and then I'm gonna type in sims x, which is gonna tell MATLAB to treat x as a variable every time it sees it. And then I'm gonna do um, f equals inline open parentheses. And if you remember, that's how we can make our function in MATLAB in the single quotation. And then I'm gonna start typing in my problem. So it's gonna be six x raised to the six times x raised to the fourth power plus four um, x four times x raised to the sixth power close single quotation comma and then the variable is going to be x hit enter um, just you know double check and make sure that your expression is exactly what you're given so you're not going to run into any sort of errors and it looks like we're good and then we're gonna use the diff operator. So I'm gonna say diff open parentheses, and I'm gonna differentiate this with respect to x. So my function is f of x, and I'm differentiating this with respect to x. And then here's the thing. So if I'm differentiating this thing twice, okay, if I just do f of x, you know, right here, if I just do f of x comma x, I'm only telling MATLAB to differentiate this problem once. So if I want MATLAB to do this again, so twice, I'm gonna do comma, two, and then close parentheses, and then it's gonna think, and then there you go. That's going to be my second derivative, okay? And just to, just to you know, make sure that you know, this is the correct answer, you can also do this problem by hand. Um, I'm only gonna do it for the first problem. So we've got six x raised to the fourth power plus four x raised to the sixth power. So basically it's going to be um, four times six. So that's gonna be, actually, let me write better. So I'm gonna do f prime of x equals, so the first derivative is gonna be, so four times six, that's gonna be 24 x. And then you take one from the power, so that's gonna be cubed plus again, four times six times four, we're gonna get 24 X and then take one off from the power. So that's gonna be X raised to the fifth power, okay? And then if I were to differentiate this one more time, so F double prime of X, I'm gonna have, so 24 times three, um, so that's gonna be 12, so that's gonna be 72 and then take one off from the power. So you're gonna have 72 X squared plus, and then um, five times 24, that's gonna be, I believe, let me do this real quick in my head. So that's gonna be one, 120, yep. That's gonna be 120, and then take one off from the power. So that's gonna be 120 X raised to the fourth power, okay? So that's going to be your second derivative. And then if we go back to MATLAB, the answer is pretty much the same. So the only thing that MATLAB does, which is really cool and I really like it, is um, it, it reduces your powers. So the, the bigger power comes first and then you know the, the lesser power comes second, okay? So for the second problem, 
and if you know my habit, I like to have a clean workstation, so I'm gonna clear everything, and then I'm gonna start over, so sims x, and then I'm gonna do f equals inline, and then open parentheses, single quotation, and then I've got a cosine, so it's gonna be cosine of three times x squared, close parentheses, close single quotation, comma, and then my variable is x. And then as always, just take a look at your expression and make sure that it kind of matches the problem that you're given, which it does. So I'm gonna do diff, which is telling MATLAB to differentiate this function for me. And my function is f of x with respect to x and then do this twice, okay? And there is my answer, okay? So super easy to take multiple derivatives in MATLAB. Just make sure that, you know, whenever you're typing your function, just write a two if you want to take the second derivative. And then if you wanted to take the third derivative, you could, you know, write three, four, whatever. Okay. So I hope this video helped. And then if it did, please drop me a like. It's really going to help out this channel and then put this video out there for other people to see. Okay. And that's about it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.